This video is to demonstrate how to connect your ASAP website to your Microsoft Access database. Uh, I'm going to divide this video into two sections. The first section will demonstrate how to connect it, and the second uh, video will uh, show you the preview of how it looks in Firefox. Uh, simply because it's complicated to load it as I'm recording. Uh, so, the first thing you need to do is go up to Tools, uh, click on Connect to Database. Now, the first time you do this, this window will pop up and it'll ask you what kind of data source you want. In our case, we want Microsoft Access Database file, so we highlight that and hit OK. Then we browse for our database. Uh, once you're in the directory, choo choose your database and hit open. Uh, then hit OK. Now I'm not going to hit OK because I'm already connected to my database, so I'm just going to hit cancel. Uh, once you connect to your database, it'll pop up in the database explorer window. And once you extend it out, you'll have you'll see your folders which shows your tables, views, procedures, and functions. So we want to display a table on our page, so we're going to go into the tables folder, and I want to I want to display my bank table on my bank page. So I'm going to drag and drop the bank table onto the bank page, and then you can enable sorting the Oh dear. So you can enable sorting, editing, and deleting, which basically means that when the website's live, a user can edit the data or delete the data. And that concludes this video. The next video will demonstrate it being previewed in Firefox. As I said, uh, I could preview it now but it'll take about 20 minutes to load it as I'm recording so thanks for watching